Hello guys, welcome back uh, to the Diamond Pole League by Fargo Rating and today I've got a really good nine ball drill. So we'll go straight into it. You'll be able to see on the diagram the way the balls are exactly set up. So for the guys that were rating under 500, you can start with cue ball in hand, but the one and the two ball must go in the side pocket. So the, the one in this side pocket, two in this side pocket, and then uh, the three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, you can take in any pocket, as long as you go in rotation and you don't bump into a ball. So that's the rules for the guys that are under 500. For the guys with rating over 500, uh, you start with uh, where the white ball is now, so it's, it's the first diamond down from the side pocket in between the eight and the nine. The one, two, that must go in the side pockets, the three must go in this corner, the four in this corner, the five in the, in the top right there, the six in the top left, the seven in either of these two corner pockets, the eight in either of these two cor corner pockets, and the nine can go in any pocket except for the, the two side pockets. And also you can't bump into a ball, so it's a really good drill for your pattern play. You're, you will play a lot of shots what you're going to play in regular ro rotation games, as, especially 9 ball and 10 ball. So we'll give it a go and I'll explain what I'm going to do on every shot while I'm playing. Right guys, so let's give it a go. So as you can see, this is where I've got to start with the cue ball. So I can't just roll this ball in because I'm going to kiss into the free ball. Uh, and, it, and if I just try and come off the uh, top rail there, the short rail, without any English, there's a good chance I'm going to kiss a 7 or the 4 and not get shaped for the 2 in the side. So yeah, I'm going to play with uh, a lot of bottom right and just let the spin do all the work. So I just want the white ball to come come around here and then really take off with the spin and come in between the 9 and the 2. So I mean, I'm playing a, a good couple of tips of bottom right and just let the spin do all the work. Landed nicely. A little funny angle. I could try and just softly roll this ball in, uh, but I believe in. But I'm still dangerous. Still probably come in with a wide ball. So I'm going to play the same shot again, short rail, and just let the spin do all the work and come back around for the free. So this time bottom left, maybe like a tip and a half this time. Just let the spin do all the work. So this time I'm going to play with follow and right and come round the back of the four and hopefully come somewhere around here. So on top of the cue ball, a good tip of right. Nicely on the four ball. So as you can see I'm avoiding traffic here, just making sure that I, I stay away from that nine ball. So the same shot again here, follow with a bit of left and come here for the five. So same again, just about a tip of left. Staying down the shot, very important. The same shot again now. Top just with a tip of left. Didn't really hit the cue ball great that time. So I've left like a, a bigger angle now than what I would have liked. Uh, I can still top it, but if I but if but if I, if I just play with it, it's just a little bit of right or no right, I'm probably gonna come here, here. And probably come come behind the nine ball. So what I'm going to do here is play with a bit more right and spin it off to two and come this way for the seven. So you just got to stay down, trust it. So I'm playing here with a, a good tip of right. Just let the cue ball do all the work. Land up perfect here on the seven ball. Just that nice little angle. So I'm just going to punch this ball in, just with maybe half a tip of left. So I just want the white ball to come out nicely here. So just below centre of the cue ball. Would have liked to have got into the cue ball a little bit more. But remember for the guys who are 500, the nine ball must go in a corner pocket. So I've got a slight angle on the, on the uh, eight. Uh, if I could take the nine in the side, I'd probably just top it in and come here for the side. Seems like I can't do that. I'm just going to play this with follow just with a touch of right. So maybe half a tip of right. Play for the nine in this corner here. A little 
bit further than what I would have liked, but shouldn't be a problem. And just play a nice little fun shot here. Just like that. So a really good drill. Good, really good, really, really good pattern drill. Uh, and good, and good because you're using all the rails and uh, more or less using all the pockets. So it's a really good pattern drill. Uh, it's not as easy as where it looks, so it takes a lot of care. But if you play the patterns right and you get the cue ball in the right spots, then the game's a lot easier. So I hope you enjoy it and uh, good luck giving it a go.